Cameron here, and I'm going to do a video today on uh, the top five applications for Mac. The first application I want to show you is VLC Media Player. Now this um, VLC Media Player is open source for any component, you know, like any, uh, um, you know, um, media format, audio format. You can also play YouTube videos. I'm going to show you guys one right now. Okay, I guess uh, by the looks of all of you here uh, in the room, you're expecting a big announcement today. I don't think we'll disappoint, but I think it also proves the old adage in the press. If the press writes something long enough and hard enough, eventually uh, it comes true. Collaboration between industry leaders is the engine for progress, and today we are extremely gratified, and I can't think of a better word, to announce that early next month, the iPhone 4 will be part of the great Verizon Wireless portfolio of products. And so I'm incredibly happy. And I that's a little sample of that. So that's VLC. It's free. Next one is uh, Geek Tool. Now this application is going to is this is you guys been asking me all this stuff like what do I use like all, how do I get all these widgets. So this is what I use for Geek Tool. You can you can customize it. You can like add scripts and everything, clock, calendar. I can show you guys you get those scripts and everything. So okay, guys, here's how you add scripts to Geek Tool or little widgets. You gotta make a, a new shell. You can do whatever, but make a new shell. Go here. This is where you edit your scripts, and you can let's just say we'll just do. Drive information. Co I'll copy that. Then we'll go to this little geek right here. This geek wit. Push right there. Save it. You know, um, change that color to you guys. Right there, you guys can see it. How much I've used. So. That's pretty much how to add stuff, and I'll, I'll explain more in a later video. So, that's Geek Tool. Next one will be next one is iWork. iWork is a suite of applications. I think for the office you have Keynote, Pages, and Numbers. Keynote is like a PowerPoint, almost the same thing. You can make videos, you know, presentations. You know, like the usual stuff. Stuff like that. Pages. Whoops. That's for like um that's exactly like Word you can just do like type and type stuff, you know. I do for like homework. And numbers that is like Excel for like your spreadsheets and stuff. The next application I want to show you is Skype. Skype is an application. I have Skype 5.0. This is a new application. You can chat with people. That's new in Skype. So check out Skype. It's pretty cool. It is pretty hard to get in full screen mode, but if you guys have Skype 5.0, you can. Forgot to mention in Skype 5.0, guys, that you can um, do multiple video chats with, with more than one person in Skype 5.0. It's a 28 day free trial in video chat in, in Skype. Last but not least is iChat, and that is where you can shoot, um, I like this thing a lot better because you can screen share with all your friends, video chat, just some with one application, it's really, really cool, it's included on Mac OS X, it supports Gmail, Google, it supports Google, um, AIM, .Mac, you know, a few other services, but yeah. 
That has been my top five applications for OS 10. Thanks for watching.